Hey, Larry. Um, you, just Mike and I thought we'd go ahead and get a video over to you. It'd be better than pictures of the tub and panels and everything. So I'm going to start off with the grab bar. Uh, this is obviously the grab bar from China. We're going to go ahead and change that, get a better quality. If you look on the back side, it's it's mounted, you know, okay, but you got to do this big plate, and they they have these little screws in here. Uh, we don't feel that it's a very quality. Uh, grab bar. I actually have this grab bar uh, machine here locally. It's a polished aluminum grab bar and we actually have it clear powder coated. And uh, this is a 6 inch version and we're going to have a 12 or we may even make it a 14 inch version that's more along the size of this and that we'll put it on angle, the 12 or 14 inch version on angle here as such and then the six inch version we're thinking of uh, putting it here as an option for the client uh, as they step in and out um, so that's what we've got on the grab bar I already have these being made and they can easily make the uh, 12 or 14 inch so that's the status of the grab bar uh, looking inward to the tub here um, the same gentleman that's working on that does the grab bars is also working on our handle it's not going to be quite like this it's actually going to be uh, a little better better quality nicer uh, action this one works pretty well we don't like the uh, chrome piece that's just glued onto the bore here and then they have a neoprene uh, part right here that presses up against that it's kind of a graduated uh, I don't know what you call that, but graduated uh, pressure as you push the bar handle down. So uh, we're actually going to do a neoprene here on the door, and I believe as well we're going to have a, a neoprene insert here. So it'll definitely uh, uh, work well for us. Um, I'm not sure where this grab bar or this uh, uh, handle comes from. Um, it may come out of China, but uh, we prefer to make our own and a better quality one. So that's the status of that. The, uh, the hinge, I know Morty uh, expressed that you know, we could, he could get it or you know, we can find a, a stainless uh, steel hinge. Shouldn't be an issue there. That shouldn't be a problem. Obviously, our, our uh, door seal here, um, not difficult to find as well. Uh, moving forward, um, the door drain is a specific door drain that we do get from Waterway. Um, I do need to talk to you a little bit about the frame underneath and that the frame cannot be too close to this door drain underneath. Um, so we'll have to you know, figure on you know, how we we'll work that. I believe since you're going to be putting wood in the floor and the seat of the tub that uh, that should uh, raise the tub up off of the frame enough uh, so that we don't have any issues. We have clearance issues right now with this tub from Hydro Systems. We actually have to grind on the backside uh, to make this door drain work. But uh, I'll go over that with you later. Uh, moving forward, um, we've got the access panel for the drain and the faucet. Um, you can see that they uh, these are just glass. They just look like regular uh, washers to me. Uh, they're glassed on. It looks like they even grind this flat or they flatten it out somehow to get it uh, to the same level uh, so that it fits flush. Uh, you've obviously drilled through, you get your magnets here and here. Go ahead and just snap that guy on, and that's how that works. Um, same thing with the Access for the equipment. Uh, you got four here and four magnets on your inset here of the tub. Same deal, just set it in here and it's going to snap into place. Um, so that's, that's how those are made. Um, as far as your extension panels, which is what I think you really were most interested in. Um, there is uh, the edge here, and that's really the edge that you're uh, looking at at the top here. I'm going to turn this around. They have uh, three clips here 
if Mike uh, zooms in and shows you these clips, it's kind of a bent uh, clip that they have here that they glass on, and uh, basically that attaches to the edge of the tub here uh, in such a fashion. I'll start with the top one here and I'm work my way down to the middle one, and I'll do the bottom one here, and just shove that in like so, and it's clipped on. Now the top extension panel is basically similar, but they had they just did like L brackets that they glassed in here. They got four of them, as you can see, and you blast them into a certain depth there. And as you can see, this just gets put on in such a manner this way. And that's pretty much it. Um, About it. Obviously, you'll have a ledger on the back side here, as long as the long edge here. Um, and that's pretty much it. So that's how the panel looks. That the and they do have a left and a right hand. This is obviously for a left hand tub, um, so they have one for each. And uh, that's pretty much it. The uh, I'll give you a little more close up of this as well. You can see down at the bottom it's just right um, the long edge. They do have this edge here and it goes up against the wall. And then of course they have this uh, bevel so that the top part can fit over that. Um, coming to the back of the top here, which I know we had discussed before, uh, we've got your um, motor mounting. Uh, bracket uh, that you mount the motors to here. These, these that we get from Hydro Systems, they come pre-drilled. They're really not drilled where we need them. Um, you know, we can discuss and you know work out exactly you know if we do drill them. You know, at your uh, facility there, we can get them drilled exactly to the units you know that we're putting on there. Um, also, you've got your computer. Um, mounting board here as well uh, to mount your computers on and uh, pretty much that's it. Morty and I have already discussed the um, legs. These legs are rusty because the tub is sitting outside the room for a few days so um, they clean right up. But uh, in any event, uh, we'll talk more about the legs and everything as well. So that's pretty much it. We'll talk to you later. Bye.